In the final years of the notary siege of pirates, the West African squadron of the British Royal Navy relentlessly pursued and seized countless slave ships, liberating thousands of enslaved Africans. One of these slave hunting ships was the HMS Black Joke and it earned its reputation as the most fearsome hunter of slave ships across the Atlantic, emancipating over 200,000 Africans from the shackles of captivity. Prepare yourself as we delve into one of the many extraordinary adventures of the Black Joke. In the far distance, a small African Latin rig fishing boat buoys into frame, riding high on a wave. The wood of the boat groans over the incessant splashing of the waves. On board, three crew fishermen expertly cast a combination of nets, floaters, and lines into the ocean. They wear traditional crew clothing, reflecting their West African heritage. Their leader is a muscular man we'll come to know as Kater Obi, a crew chieftain from a coastal village in Liberia. As a respected leader, Kater navigates the delicate balance between authority and compassion. I can't forget when Bane came home, lying tail in hand, in an unbelievable tale of bravery. He fought the fierce beast all day, finally slaying it using just a boulder and his fists. His pride swelled, and everyone wanted to hear Bayan's courageous story. That's why everyone thought Bayan would be chief back then. They worked the fishing lines with skillful hands, testament to their experience and the crew people's deep connection to the sea. Although they work intently, Hondo and Imara are listening to one of Cater's stories, a common way for the crew people to share their history, culture, and life lessons. On the eve of his crowning as chief, fate struck Bayan by the river. A scorpion's venomous sting led to his untimely demise as he succumbed to the waters shortly after. And that's why Cater is chief. So you see, sometimes it's good to be second place. Especially for Hondo. Bayan hated you. We've got something. Cater begins to pull up the line and within seconds, a small hooked fish becomes visible. Then a few feet down the line, another fish is hooked, then another. There are dozens of fish on this single line. What a bounty! As Cater draws them up, Hondo and Imara yank out the hooks and toss them in a bucket. They work together so efficiently, it's like an assembly line. 